Top 10 Biker Movies and Series. Only real bikers have seen the complete list. Bad weather, huh? Do you guys long to ride your bike? Well, don't worry, because it's time to settle in front of the TV or your laptop and watch the best motorcycle shows that you can discover. Are you guys ready to look at the list of the 10 best biker movies and series? Well, welcome back to Bikers Express, where you can get everything that a biker needs. In this video, we are introducing you to the 10 best films and series that are a must watch for every bike enthusiast. Let's start with number 10, The Sons of Anarchy from 2008. Kurt Sutter was the creator of this 2008 debuting American action slash crime drama television program. It covers the history of the biker club Sam Crow. It takes you through the fictional Californian town of Charming. Sons of Anarchy Motorcycle Club, Redwood Original. The series features a lot of violence, compelling characters, and relationships. Charlie Hunnam plays Jax Teller, a character who starts out as Sam Crow's vice president before becoming its president. He begins to have concerns about the club's direction and the illegal endeavors that they get themselves into after learning about the manifesto that his late father, John Teller, had previously commanded the group, had penned. Jax frequently disagrees with his stepfather, who took over the club after his father passed away and married Gemma Teller, his mother. If you enjoy action, drama, and motorcycles, you should definitely check out this violent, dark, and exciting show available on Netflix. Number 9, Unchained, the untold story of freestyle motocross stuntmen from 2016. This is a movie in and of itself, and Josh Brolin, who is well known for having received an Oscar nomination, serves as the narrator and guides us through the entire film. The narrator is explained to us how freestyle motocross came to be and how it has grown since then. In light of this, this is a movie that you would see if you ride a bike and are interested in the phenomenon surrounding this occurrence. There is more to the movie than just a documentary. Along with that, it explores the struggles and lifestyles of some of the most well-known bikers in the world, including Metzger, Deegan, Pastrana, Hart, and Seth. The movie also sheds lights on the lives of these motorcyclists' relatives and family members, as well as how their lives have impacted by the bikers' lifestyle. The first screening of the film took place in 2016, and it's now available on Netflix. Number 8, Burnout from 2018. This movie made its premiere in 2018. It should be noted that the movie we are discussing is truly a European production. To be more precise, the movie is a French production, making it incredibly original with a truly unique plot, one character, Tony, who is a devoted biker and the center of the entire movie. The movie follows the biker as he strives to succeed as a professional, but everything becomes more problematic when he learns that his wife is experiencing significant issues and has been involved with some criminals. Tony is currently in a difficult situation since, on the one hand, he wants to pursue his career as a professional motorcyclist, and, on the other hand, he must do everything in his power to protect his family. Fantastic and extremely well organized are the lines and overall production. The bike sections are equally stunning. This movie is worth watching even though it wasn't produced in an English-speaking country, especially if you ride a bike, and it's available on Netflix. Number 7, The World's Greatest Motorcycle Rides from 2008. This documentary series, which debuted back in 2008, is exactly what it claims to be. Henry Cole, a fan of motorbike adventures, takes you on a number of excursions throughout the globe in this series. On several continents, Henry has traveled and he has guided us through a variety of activities. There are currently 17 seasons of the show, with some seasons having more than three episodes. The show educates viewers a lot about riding cultures around the world, in addition to taking them to many stunning locations around the world. While some episodes are available on YouTube, the show airs on the Travel Channel. Number 6, The Motorbike Show. Henry Cole, a motorbike enthusiast, is the host of the well-known series The Motorbike Show, which debuted back in 2011. It has eight series so far and examines every aspect of bicycle culture and lifestyle. Countless historic bike restoration rides throughout the UK and other nations, specialized workshops, courses, races, and everything else that bike lovers enjoy taking part in will also be visible. Interviews and debates with some of the most illustrious figures in the motorcycle culture are also included. With more than 20 years of experience as a TV host, Henry Cole has amused his audiences with motorcycle knowledge and laid-back style. Every Sunday, the program airs on ITV4, and reruns are available all week. There is no doubt that the number one on this list will amaze you, so stay tuned until the very end of this video. Number 5, Gangland Undercover from 2015. 
Gangland Undercover, a drama series available on stream on History, is based on actual events described in Charles Falco's memoir, Vagos, Mongols and Outlaws, My Infiltration of America's Deadliest Biker Gangs. The program gave viewers an intriguing peek into undercover operation when it first debuted back in 2015. Sadly, after its second season, the show was cancelled. Falco, an ATF confidential informant, is the focus of the narrative. He went undercover in order to infiltrate the Vargos Motorcycle Club, one of the most prominent biker gangs. Number 4. Warrior from 2018 The first episode of this series debuted in 2018, and this movie is one of the best biker films ever made. Why? Well, we're not just talking about regular cycling events and series here. There is much more to this series. Since the entire series is centered on significant concerns that affect people's lives, there are several issues about loyalty and treachery. It is also important to note that all of this is related to war veterans who have returned home and are attempting to lead normal lives with their families. The plot and writing are quite simple and well written, and they are all mixed with excellent acting and special effects. Are you guys excited about the top 3 shows? Well stay tuned to the end, and here comes number 3. Outlaw Chronicles Hell's Angels This is another show that may be watched online at History. It centers on the Hell's Angels, one of the most infamous biker gangs in the entire world. They have thousands of members in numerous nations and are formally incorporated as the Hell's Angels Motorcycle Club. The majority of law enforcement agencies classify the club as a crime syndicate. The program gives us an in-depth look at one of the biggest motorcycle clubs in the world, and George Christie, a former chapter leader at Ventura, tells his experience. The program revealed a number of previously unknown facts concerning the club's initiations, criminal operations, and other events. Number 2. The Wild One, 1953 the Wild One, the 1953 film that established Marlon Brando as a household celebrity, is credited with popularizing the image of outlaw motorcycle gangs and making riding a bike appear pretty darn awesome. Undoubtedly, one of the most recognizable iconic images of the 1950s is Marlon Brando as the leather-clad biker Johnny Strabler. In the movie The Wild One, which also stars Lee Marvin as a rival biker gang leader, the rival gangs attack a small village after one of the leaders is detained and imprisoned. The Wild One, which received favorable views when it was initially published, has subsequently come to be regarded as a masterpiece and it's available on Netflix. And finally, at number 1, Easy Rider 1969. It should come as no surprise to movie buffs that Easy Rider from 1969 is ranked first on the list. The best biker movie, road movie, and counterculture movie in cinematic history is considered to be Easy Rider. Easy Rider, starring Peter Fonda and Dennis Hopper as two counterculture bikers, who go from Los Angeles to New Orleans to sell drugs and explore America, is credited with revolutionizing the cinema industry. Easy Rider is a legendary film, and the go-to motorcycle movie directed by Dennis Hopper and co-starring Jack Nicholson as an alcoholic lawyer that the motorcyclists pick up on the road. The careers of Dennis Hopper and Peter Fonda were also influenced by this picture, which also demonstrated that both art films and exploitation movies could be made about motorcycles. Thus, we are done with our list. What are you waiting for? Go and watch these biker flicks listed above and share your valuable reviews in the comment section below. Now that we've helped you enjoy your bad weather evening by watching interesting biker stuff, please help us grow by subscribing to this channel and also enabling the bell icon for more interesting content. Also check out some other interesting biker stuff on our channel, and with that said, adios.